Howdy. So today we're going to be doing a, uh, an EGR passenger on a 2002 E340 Mercedes. And I got it exposed. You got to pull your air, your tubes off and stuff. Get your snoot out of the way. And your EGR is right here. And you got these female or male torques. You get this one here. That one there. You want to get this here. And get this nut here. So the problem was was that you were unable to open your EGR to kill the engine with a vacuum tool. And you do that by hooking onto this hose here. It just wasn't working so we gotta actually clean out the passages. You just wanna get this loose like it is and take the connector off and then we'll go ahead and go after our bolts there and down here. So this is what the blockage is on your EGR tube. So you wanna take some carb spray maybe uh, a wire go through there and clean all out. This is what's keeping your engine from having the EGR operate properly. So, got the tube out and stuff like that. You saw the picture, so you gotta go in here with like, a, like an old piece of a speedo cable and put it in a drill or something like that. It'll just spray a whole bunch of carbon spray, clean it out, disconnect it from your EGR tube, and then just clean it out because this is usually what's plugged up and gives you the code. So, we'll just put it back together and put a little bit of red RTV on our gaskets we put it back in and that should fix our problem so I got it somewhat back together at least so that mass airflow is plugged in and stuff you don't have a vacuum leak so I hooked up my vacuum gauge or vacuum tool up to my uh, EGR and so we're gonna see if it's gonna make the engine die now so it makes it die so it means everything's working the vacuum gauge is stuck so that's it guys, thanks for watching. Um, so you could see in my video there that it, the engine was dying. It, you really couldn't see it in the video, but what I did is I took a vacuum gauge, like a Mighty Vac, or what I actually ended up doing was I just hooked a piece of tubing up to my hose, or to my outlet for my uh, EGR vacuum diaphragm, and I sucked it flat with my mouth and it killed the engine. So then I knew that my passage was clean. So uh, thanks for watching guys, and I hope this is helping you guys be your own mechanic. Um, if you have any questions, just comment below, give me a like if you like the video, um, and I'm always really appreciative of you guys taking your time and watching my video so I can help somebody out and make, save some money. So thanks for watching, and uh, give me a like or subscribe, and have a good one.